But much of the nation was waiting for today's recommendation from the CDC. More than 3,000 kids are pre-registered for a COVID-19 vaccine at Louisville's Norton Healthcare. Crews prepared six sites today after the FDA approved Pfizer vaccines to be administered to the kids as young as 12 years old. Tonight, Gabrielle Agadis is talking with a pediatrician tonight who shares advice for hesitant parents. This is one of the sites where children between the ages 12 and 15 can get vaccinated. A parent or guardian will walk through the entire process with them. The only main difference uh, that we'll have is there is a consent process at the, as the first step. Six sites led by Norton Healthcare will soon administer vaccines to kids as young as 12 years old. More than 3,000 of them have registered. We are excited about that number. I'll say that. Um, it, it hopefully is a sign that this community is continuing to want to get vaccinated. As soon as they say, yep, the doors are open, uh, we're, we're going to be standing in line. Matthew Bowdy has two boys, a 17 year old and a 12 year old. His oldest son is fully vaccinated. And my 14 year old is is upset that he hadn't had the chance yet, so he's he's excited to be able to, to get that taken care of. Remote learning was one of the motivating factors. He's done fine with it, but he, he's a, a very social kid. Bowdy has trust in the science. He just wants to protect his kids. The concern, I think, was less for our, our both of our boys. Um, it was more that they could be carriers. Um, and that they might give it to someone else. Dr. Daniel Blatt says children are vital if we want to get to herd immunity. Really the only way we can get there is by including everyone in the effort. 5% of the population is about is, is ages 12 to 15 years old. And that's a huge amount of people that we need. Blatt says all vaccines will naturally have side effects and it's usually a good sign. When your child gets vaccinated, don't be alarmed if there is fever or if there is muscle pain, or if they do feel unwell for a short period of time. Uh, that's their immune system really ramping up and creating antibodies the way it's supposed to. Norton Healthcare will host a Facebook Live tomorrow addressing questions and concerns parents may have about vaccines for children. We'll post the information on whes11.com. For now reporting, I'm Sanai Gabrigadigas.